Hello chat boxes out there, today in this vlog I'm going to be telling you guys all about what I got to on my Wednesday evening, my Thursday and my Friday. I hope you guys are all having a lovely end to your week. On my Wednesday evening I got back from work and me and my older brother and sister and our final friend went off on a massive evening stroll and we went Pokemon Go catching and then got back and I had some bacon and egg for my tea and I'm going to show you guys a photo of that now. The bacon and egg was so good. I had smoked bacon which was my favourite bacon. I then had one of my custom slices with a cup of tea and I'm going to show you guys a photo of that now. It was so good. Then my older sister went off home, so did our final friend. I then watched the UK soaps and I'm a celebrity. First write up my journal, sort out my booty doll, listen to a bit of music, and then I was just watching a bit of Netflix. I then went off to bed, and then on my Thursday, I got up, showered and changed, ready for work, had some breakfast, I had some toast and a cup of tea. My mum was up, and we were just watching a bit of TV just before I went off to work. And my dad, older brother, sister, and younger brother and sister were all at work. I then got ready to go off to work. I then headed off and went off to the corner shop. I got myself a drink and some bits of bottom there and I got two flower snaps from the little flower display they have outside of Audi that I'm going to show you guys now. Such pretty colours. I then got to work, got clocked in, put my bag in coach away and it was my first shift back with the reopening after it had been shut for refurb and also the launch of the new spring menu so all very exciting and all very shiny and new and so I was having a look around at the new bits and pieces that we'd had done and I'm going to show you guys some photos of the refurb that I got now. It's so lovely, nice and cosy. We've got a new little sofa area with a nice little lantern. I know that I'm going to end up banging my head on that lantern because it's a little bit low when putting food and drinks on the table, but I just have to learn to mind the lamp. And yeah, it was an all nice and new layout. So we're going to have to have a new table layout and also get used to the new food menu. And also the tail had changed a bit. So I think my boss, has changed it back because it was a little bit it changed for some reason and first thing I did before the doors opened to let the customers in was put lots of sugar pots on tables and just get menus out we had to f have it printed on paper because the laminated ones hadn't come yet so I just put a load of paper ones out on the tables and then the customers arrived and lots of people mentioning about the refurb and how nice it looked and about the menu and it went well the food looks amazing it's making me very hungry and i was wanting lots of food and drinks cleaning tables doing food and drink orders and bill taking and there's only three of us on and it did get quite busy it was quite quiet to start off with and then we had quite a busy lunch rush and then it calmed down again and i just did a massive clean up and we had people sitting inside and outside and i was just polishing cutlery putting cuts and plates away and doing cleaning jobs and then I saw one of our colleagues who was off in Canada for a little bit he's been doing skin stretching over there she's back for a few weeks and she I had my, my back turned to her and she she came in and made me jump and I was like oh my god and gave her a massive hug I was asking all about her travels and then I was finished I clocked off got my bag and I got changed into a t-shirt and got a mirror selfie in front of the new mirror we have in my workplace which is so pretty. Reminds me of the mirror from Harry Potter where you like see what you most desire. I cannot remember the name of it but it reminds me of that mirror. I then headed off and I went off to one of the flower shops and I got some flower sets that I'm going to show you guys now. It's 
such lovely colours on the flowers. I was then just having a lovely chat with the flower shop keeper. I then got some plants out from there that I'm going to show you guys now. Lovely patterns on the plants. I love the succulents, cactuses, and all the hanging plants from the windowsill. So pretty. I then went off and got myself a Greg's lunch. I then got home, I got changed, and I had my Greg's that I'm going to show you guys the food of now. The Greg's are so good. I haven't had one in ages because they used to shut at 3 o'clock. So I finished work at 3, go to get a Greg's, and they'd be shut. But then I'll stay open later, which meant I was able to get myself a Greg's. And after work, I was so hungry, so I definitely needed it. And I then got myself ready to go off for a little stroll and I headed off and I got some flower slats that I want to show you guys now. Such lovely flower slats out and about that I'm able to get photos of at the moment and I'm loving that. Also loving the blue skies and the sunshine. I then got home and I got ready for touch rugby. My old row was back for be at work and he went off to go to rugby training himself and my dad was at a disco and then our family friend came and picked me up and we headed off to touch rugby. My older sister didn't go to touch rugby as her hay for has been playing up, bless her. And touch rugby was really good. It was really hot and I was actually melting, but it was really good, really fun, really quick pace. I said it was a great passing and catching and even managed to score myself a try, which I was very happy about. And then me and my family friend went off to Aldi and then to Tesco's and got some bits and bobs and I didn't have my phone which had my card in so my mate bought the stuff for me and then when he brought me home I gave him the money that I owed him and then he went off home and I then got showered and into my PJs and then had my tea. I just took a for tea and I'm going to show you guys a photo of that now. The chicken curry was so good, not as spicy as last week's. Last week's curry I had, I thought my mouth was gonna was on fire. And my dad was back from doing his disco, and then my older brother got back from being at his rugby training. And then I watched the UK soaps and watched I'm a Slab, finished off my journal, listened to a bit of music, sort out my Bluetooth doll, and then I was just watching a bit of Netflix. I then went off to bed and then on my Friday, which is today, I got up after a nice line. I then got showered and changed and had some of my pancakes. I didn't have many pancakes this time. I've got proper big pancakes that you just put in the microwave and had some of those, which was strawberries and blueberries and had that with a cup of tea for my breakfast that I want to show you guys a photo of now. It was so good. The strawberries and the blueberries didn't have any sugar or golden syrup, trying to be a little bit healthier. And then I was just watching this film called My called The Wedding Date, which stars the one who played Grace Adler in Will and Grace, and it's so good. Typical warm calm. And yeah, I love that. Then I was just listening to a bit of music, playing on Pokemon Go and Subway Surfer and watching some vlogs and TikToks. And my dad went fishing after work and my older brother and sister and younger brother and sister were at work. And my mum had gone with my grandma to see my grandpa in hospital, who's doing amazingly well, considering how a few months back they thought it would be curtains. He's able to stand up with a little like zimmer frame thing and he's doing so much better. He's still a little bit cuckoo, but he's still a lot more with it and he's able to know now when he's getting a bit confused and he's hoping to be out into a little a rehab centre and then hopefully be able to come home soon, fingers crossed, hoping to go see him soon. And then I locked up and took my key with me and my bag and went off to go for a little stroll and whilst on my stroll, I got this beautiful red flower snap that I'm going to show you guys now, signed by lovely bluebells. It's so beautiful. I then went off and had a look around the charity shop and headed off to my workplace. And I tried out the French toast of the new menu and had that with a chai latte. 
and sat in the new sofa area. I'm going to show you guys a photo of that now. It was so delicious. Definitely my new thing on the menu so far and makes up for not having any pancakes on the menu like they had last year on the spring menu. And then it was quite busy. So I ended up helping out on my day off, just cleaning a few tables here and there and taking a few food and drink orders, cleaning some tables and taking stuff to pot wash that needed to be taken out. And my colleagues on shift were very grateful for my help. I said, no problem, helping the team out. And one of my bosses was actually working in the kitchen and he was, he was like, oh, thanks, Dan. And my grandma and my mum are back from seeing my grandpa in hospital and they actually were in my workplace having food themselves. And I was just sat down by the surf area having my lunch and so I waved up to them and one of my colleagues kind of got a photo of me which is now my Facebook profile photo of me sat on the sofas and my hair looks great I'm smiling for a change and don't look too bad so I was very grateful for her taking a quick photo of me sat in a little new sofa area my personal photographer from now on she's got the job tick and then I finished my child latte, sat over with my mum and my grandma, having a nice chat with them, asking how grandpa's getting on. And he's doing a lot better, which is great. Doing leap and, leaps and bounds, as they say. And then my mum and grandma headed home. I then went off to one of the flower shops, the one that was shut yesterday, and got some flower sacks on there that I'm gonna show you guys now. Always such lovely flowers in there, smells so good, and I was having a nice chat with the flower shop keepers in there. I then headed off and I went to Aldi and got myself some little pickles, pickled like cut up ones, like thin cut up ones you get in the burgers for my dogs. Got some of those, and they're so good. I love gherkins, so pickled gherkins. And then I got home, and my grandma had dropped my mum home, and then she'd gone home. And then I had a cup of tea and some biscuits, and me and my mum would just listen to a bit of music. My older brother's now apart from being at work, and I was just listening to a bit of music, doing some drawing and colouring in. I then sorted out my pizza doll and got my uniform ready for work tomorrow. It's supposed to be really hot and sunny, so I'm going to be wearing my work shorts again. And in the evening, we're going to be having a barbecue and then having a sibling games night. I think I've here or at my old sister's place, I'm not quite sure yet, but looking forward to that. And I am doing a nine to three, and then on Sunday, I'm doing nine to five. I was supposed to do a split, but I'm doing my colleague's day shift and she's doing my evening. So, no, I was supposed to be doing an evening shift, but she's doing my evening shift, and I'm doing her day shift. So, only doing nine to five, but she's, I didn't have any evening shifts. I hate evening shifts. I love my bed, I like an early night and so very happy about that and then i'm working so i'm working saturday sunday monday tuesday and i'm off wednesday thursday friday and i'm hoping to have a catch up with my colleagues on thursday as we're both free on thursday so i'm going to talk to her about that and i'm now off to go and watch today's home and away and then just write a bit of my more of my journal then i'm probably just gonna chill I think for tea, we, I, we might either be having takeaway or I, think I might just make myself some scrambled egg. Really craving a bit of scrambled egg at the moment. And yeah, I hope you guys have all had a lovely week. All have a lovely weekend ahead. Please like, comment and subscribe. And I shall see you with a new vlog coming very soon. Bye.